Hello and welcome, welcome to Gloss of Telly about stories what newspapers dare not print. Kipper short cut route. No messing. No bumping into people. Muddy. But then you've got a grand little walkway down there. Well, the best thing about living in Glossop is is this. It is, is is this, for example, because there's no strip, there's no lighting, there's no CTV. It's quite safe. You just walk all the way down. There's no one up there ready to jump. You have a pair of kippers, please. How are you doing? Yeah, yeah. Do that, it's all Simon. No, I did see you. Got two uh, pair of mains kippers. And also two mackerel, Cornish mackerel butterflies. Come on. It's our bus back to get the lemon. I forgot the lemon. Yo, we just get the lemon. Yes, I eat that. <laughs> what I did, I got some chilies and a lemon. Some chilies with cheese and toast and a lemon, two lemons. Come on. Yeah, so I've just had, had a visitor around the kippers. Go towards. As any kipper lover will know, you have to deal with the aroma of the kipper, which many, many people object to. Two kippers, bank small. Yeah, the important issues in Glossop are the state of uh, the state of Lloyd's Bank and the uh, the town hall. We can't use the town hall because we had that French tourist over. I didn't know he was. Uh, he made the front page of the Glossop Chronicle complaining about how rude people are in Glossop. He was. He said it's a beautiful place, and he was happy he came on holiday. But he said we was all rude. Well, that's not true. Just a bit of bro. I was away from Glossop uh, five years. Oh yes, I did want to come back to Glossop. Mm. Why? Because I like kippers and I like the hills. And I was born here. I mean, why? Do you, is he why to it? Because I like it. Do I have to explain why for every time? I think one of the great things is what Nelson Mandela said. He said, if, you're, if a human wants a bit of happiness in life, live within at least 50 miles from where you were born. And there's truth in that. You see a lot of people, these communities scattered throughout England with people there, you know, they don't belong, they're not lost, they're, you know, with no sense. I, I know what I mean. Mm. So you think Glossop should be for the Glossopians? Oh, no, 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 absolutely not. No, no. I would say move to Glossop. You can have pudding chips and gravy, kippers, fine ales, great people. Lovely, yeah, yeah. And it's Derbyshire, isn't it? And the Peak District, got Ayrn, Shorthead, Owls, Longendale Trail, me. It's endless things to do. Endless things to do. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the girl's lovely, yeah. Very nice. Fresh face, you can see it's the good air, good living. Uh, the politics in Glossop are... Next week I'm going to cook grilled mackerel with a, a fresh herby sauce to go on top. Yeah? Don't miss it. I'll make this little sauce 
Try some spring onions, chilies, lemongrass, fresh herbs, a bit of fish sauce, and then with, and then put that on top of the uh, the grilled mackerel. And wow, man! I did. I made that the other week and had a little tear in my eye. Either that god. It was truly was. I know all gossip now. Most gossip. Work with people from the past.